Here is what happened on the latest edition of Morning Glory. All right, now, I was uh, talking just a short while ago about a footballer who has come out uh, the closet and retired German football star uh, Thomas Hitzelsberger today became the first Premier League footballer to come out as gay after recently realising he preferred men. Uh, The 31-year-old German international midfielder who ended his playing career in September due to persistent injuries said he came out in a bid to break the taboo of homosexuality in sport. In what is a landmark moment for football, he told Germany's Die Zeit newspaper that now was a good time for him to reveal his sexuality. Uh, The retired footballer said he has only realised in the past few years he'd he'd, uh, prefer to live together with another man, saying the issue was otherwise taboo inside the dressing room. I've never been ashamed of the way I am, he added, although he conceded it's not always been easy to live with some of the comments dished out on the subject. Uh, Just picture 20 men sat around a table together drinking. you just got to let the majority be, just as long as the jokes are halfway funny and the talk about homosexuality doesn't get too insulting, he said. In England, Germany or Italy, homosexuality is not taken seriously as an issue, at least not in the dressing room. And the 31-year-old is the first high-profile German player to publicly reveal that he's uh, uh, gay. Justin Fashion, who was the first professional footballer in Britain to come out in 1990 before he took his own life eight years later, aged 37. Uh, but he actually never played in the Premier League. Um, Hitzelsberger played 52 times for Germany between 2004 and 2010 and spent his club career at Aston Villa, uh, VFB Stuttgart, Lazio, West Ham United, VFL Wolfsburg and Everton. Uh, but he used to live with the fiance Inga Tutsua, but split up with her in June 2007, only one month before they were due to wed. And now we know why. But uh, good for him. And um, I, I think it's uh, only fair to say that there's probably lots of other uh, gay sportsmen around. And um, if they could come out enough of them and make it re- make other sportsmen realise it's just the normality, you know, uh, then that can't be a bad thing, can it, really? Live on 96FM Morning Glory.